When light strikes an object, it can be absorbed, it can pass through the object, or it can bounce off its surface. When light bounces off the surface of an object, we call it reflection. Right now, light is coming from the bulb above me and reflecting off me and all of the objects that you can see around me. And the color of an object actually affects how much light is reflected off its surface. Here, I have two toy cars. One is black and the other is white. When I turn off the lights, the white car is easier to see. That's because the color white reflects the most light, while the color black absorbs much of the light instead of reflecting it. Here you see a plastic toy dog standing in front of two surfaces. Now, light is reflecting off both of these surfaces but I see a blank white square on the left and an image of the dog on the right. If light is reflecting off both surfaces, why is there only an image of the dog on the right? When light bounces off a rough surface, the light gets scattered in every direction. That makes the image so blurry and distorted that your mind doesn't see an image at all. All you see is a white square. But when light bounces off a smooth surface, all the light bounces off in the same direction. This causes an image to form on the smooth surface, and we call this image a reflection. Mirrors are designed to have smooth surfaces where images form, but an image can form on any smooth surface. Light and its reflections travel in straight lines, and earlier I used my aquarium and a laser to demonstrate this. Here you can see the light from the laser reflecting off the smooth glass walls of the aquarium. Light actually reflects off smooth surfaces like this in a very predictable way. The law of reflection actually describes how light reflects off a smooth surface. And it tells us that light reflects off smooth surfaces in a symmetrical way. You can see here that no matter what angle the laser strikes the mirror at, the light is reflected in a symmetrical way. This is still true when light is reflected off more than one mirror. So here I have a laser aimed at a mirror and four plastic dinosaurs that are all different colors. So here's your question. When I turn the laser on, the laser beam will shine on which of these dinosaurs? Take a minute and discuss that with your classmates, then I'll be back to talk about the answer. It's important that you understand that light reflects off mirrors and other smooth surfaces in a symmetrical way. Because of that, I would predict that the laser beam will shine on the green dinosaur. And when I turn on the laser, that's exactly what I see. The light reflects in a symmetrical way and shines on the green dinosaur. I'm sure that's what you and your classmates came up with, and I hope this video has helped you understand reflection a little better. Keep up the great work, and I'll see you next time.